for as long as I can remember, it's always been just me and Alan. Our dad's been out the picture. Last time we seen our mom, she was drugged out, passed out. Talk about being embarrassed. Alan been the one making sure we eat and have clothes on our backs. Alan always been the quiet guy, very smart and move slow. It's not often you see him angry, but when you do, you better watch out. One thing for sure, don't play with his time or money. Alan started hustling to make it in these streets. Being so young, he had older men working for him. He was booked and street smart. Alan put his best friend Frank to work. Mama always told Alan to stop being friends with Frank. She just knew he wasn't shit, but he'd been there when Mama was gone. He made Alan a lot of money, so he wasn't going nowhere. Alan knew he couldn't be a hood nigga forever, so he got out the streets and got his law degree. Now Frank, Frank gonna die a hood nigga. Still on the same block, doing the same shit. What's up, man? What's up, Frank? Where's the bag at? There you go. That's living light, don't you think? Calm down. I got the rest in the trunk. We fuck with my time, Frank. Come on, man. Nobody fuck with your time. I'm telling you. You just see the money, man. Back up. It's all there? Huh? It's all there, man. Uh. Got the rest in the bag. Now where the rest of the stuff at? Come on, man. I just told you. Just bag the fuck up first. Huh? What the fuck you doing, Frank? What I'm doing? What the fuck you doing? What I'm doing? Getting paid, nigga. Get the fuck back. You ain't got to play it like this. Yeah, it's getting played today. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Christmas came early, huh? <laughs> All right. Now, you should do me a favor. Be a happy camper. And get your dumb ass in the trunk. Come on. Let's that's go. we're doing it? Yeah, that's right. Come on. All Get right. comfortable, baby. There you go. Now, don't worry. Make sure you don't get wet. <laughs> Kendra. Baby, I told you, I was going to do that, right? Yeah, and I did it. <laughs> I told you, baby, I'm standing on business, Kendra, all right? And I'm going to get you that house. We're going to be straight. I love you too, girl. Fucked up acting about you. Yeah, OK. OK, love you too. I'm still selling drugs in your neighborhood. No I'm still making rounds with the money good. No I'm still hanging around all the drug dealers. Hey. I'm still hanging around all the killers. All the killers. I still walk <sighs> around with my jewelry. Oh. I still got the big Glock 40. Pow, pow, pow. I still got the hollows with the tips. Tips, nigga. Swear to God, I bust a nigga dead. I'm still juggling and finessing. Do you just get a kick out of keeping my hands tied in your BS, man? Look on the bright side. I got you bailed out. I need you to chill out. You got me bailed? No, I think it's all the money I've been paying you. It's got me bailed out. Let's get something clear, Alan. I ain't going back to prison. So whatever you got to do to make that happen, make it happen. Frank, man, 
You must really think I'm black Jesus. Appreciate the compliment, though. Listen. Look at this right here. That's your record. Now, you sold to an undercover cop. A detect. You got my hands tied here, man. Now, I got the DA. Talk about seeing you down for a long time. Best I could do right now is try to reduce your time. You could help me out by chilling out. Lay low. Put it together. Damn. You know, Alan, I feed your family well, right? Hmm? Um, let's not forget, it was my money that got you through law school. So how the money you've been taking from me all these years, you need to make sure I stay out of prison. Or else. Or else what? Let's also not forget, I've been saving your ass for a long time. Since we was kids. We walked the same paths. You decide to stay left. I decide to go right. But for some reason, I'm the one that's still saving you. Saving your ass. Now, Looking at this track record, look at your file, looking at this, you don't make wise decisions. So I will ask you, is it really wise for you to be threatening me right now? Especially knowing the fact that I control your fate of your life right now. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't mean to be laughing. I'm not humorously anyway. But you see how you just switch? Hmm? From a lawyer to a, to a street nigga? You right. We did choose two different paths. We took the whole way out. I took the life I was born for. So what you think this law office of yours? <laughs> Your little suits. Make you better than me? Nah. You a street nigga, Alan. Always have been. Always will. Look, man. Just make it happen, all right? Alan. The fiance of yours is mighty, mighty fine. Hey, man. Keep my girl name out your motherfucking mouth. Oh, no disrespect, bro. Just saying you still got good taste. Or should I say, she got good taste. <laughs> Make it happen, Alan. He's coming, he's coming. Yo, shh, yo, he's coming. Yo, he's coming, he's coming, yo, he's coming. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, I appreciate you so much. So, Katie, I'm not going to see my leader. I know you haven't seen him in years. No, my boy. Uh, yes. No. <laughs> he over there? Mm -hmm. Oh, my. Hey. What's up, boy? 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 So what you talking about cats? Cause I just cannot. I mean, they're cute. Cute in what way? Every way. Like even though they kind of be doing too much, they be climbing on stuff. Like I don't know. And then they be scratching me. Like exactly. Boy. Just why? They look cute sometimes. Lori been showing up these um, past few days. He been doing me good on my best. I ain't gonna lie. So just stay with it. Breaking even. I'm gonna give you $5. That's it. Yeah. You ain't getting no more than $5. I really don't know about Houston. 
but I've been to Vegas and it's just as hot. It's hot as hell. You are so right about that. I don't even know how they keep their money over there. There's no way I can have money if I'm in Vegas. I'll probably go back to Vegas next year. It's pretty good. It's hot as hell, but I'll go. Okay. It's your business. All right, hey, that's that's it. It. That's that's it. It. I'll give you five dollars. Nah, definitely. You can have five dollars. All right. Gordon. Mm -hmm. So, what are y'all in here talking about? Girl, I'm just trying to figure out if I want to quit my job or go into this business consulting. I mean, what do you think is best? I told her to focus on the business, because, girl, you ain't gonna never really have time with all the hours you be working. That is true. I mean, I do like my job, though, y'all. Like, it does pay good, and I am up for a promotion, but I don't know. So what's more important, the promotion or the business you've been passionate about for the best 10 years? Mm-hmm. The bills. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true, true. <laughs> Girl, I feel you on that. I mean, I remember when I went through this a couple years ago, it was the hardest decision that I ever had to make. I had to make so many sacrifices. Hell, I was eating ramen noodles for months. Not the ramen. <laughs> But was it worth it? Every minute of the struggle was worth it. Do you hear me? I mean, you've been out here down game, killing the game, girl. Mm -hmm. Girl, trust me when I tell you this. It was not easy. I spent many, many nights just crying, begging, pleading, praying to God to give me strength, not to give up. I was battling my own thoughts and emotions. Well, you know, whatever you decide, sis, you know, we got you. And besides, your smart ass can just get another job if this don't work out. <laughs> exactly. I mean, what we need to know is, who is this blowing your phone up? Right. And why you say the sound in the voice now? Okay, look, I fucked up. And I'm scared. Fucked up? What happened? What the hell, Amaya? So, I met up with this guy who slid in my DMs back when me and Alan was going through our hiccup a couple weeks ago. Amaya. What happened? You might as well tell him. He starts calling me, right? And we start having these long conversations on the phone. I mean, he seems sweet enough. So gullible. And then he wanted to take me out. So, I decided to go out with him. But to be honest with you, I don't remember half of what happened that night. Are you drug you? I have no idea. Like, it all seems like a blur. And, and I've been trying to get rid of him, but he keeps calling from all these different numbers. And I don't know. I don't know, girl. I, I never should have opened that DM. Damn, girl, he calling you more than the bill collector. Nah, I mean, that's a lie. Does Ally know? No. Of course it's Stacy. Of course he doesn't know. I don't even know how to tell him even if I should. Don't. I mean, we wasn't together when it happened, but I regret every any of it. But you know what? It's clearly this guy don't get the picture that you no longer want to deal with him anymore. No. You know, you gotta watch out for stuff like that, Amaya. You really do. Nah, no, I agree with Brenda. That shit is giving up sense. You can't take shit like that like this. Okay, look, I'm handling it, okay? Fix it. Okay, I'll be right back, all right? If Alan asks for me, just tell him I went down the street. I'll be right back. Are you crazy? She will get herself killed. Listen. She will get us killed. She will get herself killed. Oh, shit, I'm running. Amaya. Sweet. What do you want, Michael? I told you, we are done. Whatever this is, it's over. Hell, it was a mistake from the beginning. I mean, what you saying? The conversation we had meant nothing to you? No. <laughs> what was it supposed to mean? We talked on the phone a few times. You seem sweet, but that's it. That was it? That's it. That's it. That's it. So you don't remember, huh? What is there to remember? 
thought I'd refresh the little memory of yours. Hmm? Check your phone. <laughs> it's always something with you, isn't it? If it ain't enough. You like that? Michael, what is this? Recorded me without my consent? Oh no, see, I, I have full consent. Don't worry, your fiance to get a copy of this with me. I mean, you want a good performer anyway. Say, Frank. You thought you were just gonna take all that money and wasn't gonna find you? Look, I posted not you where I live, huh? What the fuck? I knew you was a shyster ass nigga. It's my money. Your money. You want that shit back, nigga? Get it back in blood, then. Fuck this nigga, man. Go get you something from the store. What you got for me, man? What you got for me, man? You know, same thing every day. Every day. On, you man. still owe me money, man. On, man. Where my money is? Like man, I don't want that hey, shit. Man, man where the my money? Like hey, kid! Break it, Bravo! Oh, shit! Hey! Come here! Oh. Baby. What's going on? What's wrong? Can we just can we just talk about it later? I don't want to talk about it right now. At least not with everybody here. What do you, what do you mean you want what is going on? You want me to kick everybody out? I can do that. What is going what is this? Talk to me. Baby, I'm sorry, okay? I'm I'm so, so, so sorry. What happened? So I I started seeing this guy. You are my fiance. We are supposed to be getting married soon. And then you go see another guy? And now he won't leave. Did you fuck him? Did you fuck him? You fucking fucked. Oh my but, 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 god. I don't remember any of that. I promise you, I don't even remember going back to his place. I, oh my god. After all these years. There's more. More? What are you talking? Please don't tell me that's what I think it is. He recorded us. Recorded who? He and I in his bed. But baby, I are promise you, you, I promise you, I don't remember any of that. I don't even. I Did you suck? 
This is our fucking bed. Our bed. Babe, you say it was his bed. I don't remember. I don't even. I don't remember anything, babe. I really. This is Frank. Someone I grew up with. I'm finna fucking kill him. I'm finna kill. I'm gonna kill him. I try to leave that lifestyle alone. I try. Let's talk. Look, this street life that you think you want, it's not what you think it is. Shit gets ugly out here. Hell, it's a slimy world out here. Look how you got your little brother out here moving and shaking, man. I got no business being out in these streets. I'm sorry. I don't want to hear it. You ain't, no, no. Get everybody out of here. When I get back, I'm dealing with your ass.